What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Anthony Joshua. Get this. Anthony Joshua has reported that he will fight another two years, then he is retired. That's if his body uh, makes it. Okay, so uh, let me counterpunch, I think. Um, you guys, if you guys remember back in 2021, that's my timestamp. This is uh, a picture of the thumbnail of the video that was reported three years ago or nearly three years ago that Anthony Joshua said that I will fight another five years. So it's consistent. It's right on track. You know, um, I think Anthony Joshua trains like the Dickens. That, that dude is a gym rat. And to condition yourself the way to prepare to fight, to box, is a job by itself, okay? A full-time job, and Anthony Joshua takes it very seriously, you know? And, you know, conditioning yourself can cause injuries. That means you're putting strain, you're putting pressure, you know, you're putting a lot into training, okay? It's nothing that's supposed to be comforting, okay? You know what I mean? You're supposed to be hardened, be tough. So it does weigh a toll on your body. Make no mistake about it. Ask Mickey Wark, right? Ask guys that think they can box and see how far they get. You know what I mean? It is a job. It is something that everybody can do. And... um it does make you wonder, though, if Anthony Joshua has any type of injuries that he's not talking about. You know, we still haven't heard anything from the 2019 June 1st incident where he got caught one time in the temple and this man crumbled and he never recovered. OK, so he got that title of being chinny, chinny. So that's where it came from. But a lot of people rumored that he was already injured. So. You know, a lot of people knew about it. A lot of people knew that, hey, AJ's uh, concussed. He got knocked out in sparring, and he's going to fight anyway. That means we have a shot. And that is before Jarrell Miller popped dirty. So Jarrell Miller's team knew about that. Okay, so, you know, I think his team is ran like a weld oiled machine, okay, because they don't talk about a lot of things. If AJ says a lot of anything about someone, and it gets public, it immediately gets withdrawn. If you remember that Joshua ridiculed Deontay Wilder about fighting Dominic Brazil because he was the first one to dethrone and take that O from Dominic Brazil, and he was like, Brazil? You fighting Brazil? You know what I mean? He's taking over my leftovers, and they cut it, and then you can't find any more of that footage. So I don't even know how that got out. I'm just giving you guys an example where a lot of things don't get out of that camp, okay? A lot of things don't. So, you know, if anything, I feel that we have a AJ that is going to retire in two years. You know, three years ago, he said five. And I think that's a good number, you know? And I think it all depends on how he wins or not. You know what I mean? If he wins, if he's victorious, if he can become undisputed or a three-time heavyweight world champion, I think that all resides on that. My question is, what if it don't happen? Will he still retire? You know what I mean? He's been taking tutelage lessons from Vladimir Klitschko, and Vladimir Klitschko fought to age 41. So, you know, we just have to wait and see. You know, but I'll say this about AJ. You know, AJ did his job. And... Him and Vladimir are the ones that do their job. They fight the mandatories. They do what's expected of them being a champion. That's the definition of being one, able to do those type things. So, you know, um, this is not really a big surprise to me. Not at all. Um, I think, you know, a fighter can't stay around forever. And, and it looks like, you know, the wind is shifting in his favor of getting the opportunity to fight for a world title again. You know what I mean? So he lost those belts to Usyk. Uh, he fought him again. He come up short. Now he's an opportunity and a position to go forth 
you know, and to fight for that title. So things are looking good for AJ. So if I'm AJ and the way things are going, I would be saying two years too, because you get the belts, then you defend it a couple times, then you, you out, right? So I think that's what that is. You know, um, you guys tell me what you think of AJ, Anthony, Joshua, Big Femi stating that he's going to retire in two years. If his body holds up, of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunch. Peace.